war never changes. Hej, witam was bardzo serdecznie, ja jestem Viver, to jest kolejny odcinek gry Fallout 4 i dzisiejszy odcinek rozpoczniemy sobie od zwiedzenia krypty o numerze 81. I z tego, co zapewne większości Was wiadomo, krypty były stworzone nie tylko po to, żeby ocalić ludzi przed wojną atomową, czy tam atakiem nuklearnym, ale miało to też swoje drugie dno, mianowicie Voltek wykorzystywał krypty właśnie do przeprowadzania różnych eksperymentów. I tak jak mieliśmy w przypadku krypty 111 eksperyment związany z tym, jak ludzie znoszą hibernację, a w innych kryptach były to przeróżne inne eksperymenty. Ok, co mam się dowiedzieć? Coś na temat mojego pitboya. Why are you asking about my pit boy? We get plenty of scavengers and traders passing by the entrance. Everybody wants to get at the shiny red button. But you're the first one to try it with a working pit boy. Now where'd you get it? Just open the damn door. I don't think so. Ups. Ok, dobra, to nam wyszła ta rozmowa jak wcale. Dobra, w takim razie spróbujemy jeszcze raz. Vault 81 Security. Ready to explain that pit boy? I got it in Vault 111. Vault 111? Haven't heard of that one yet. And what sort of business are you looking to take care of here in 81? What's with the third degree? It's called protocol. Think we just let anyone in here? Think again. Who is it, Edwards? Ma'am. Some new Commonwealth traveler. Not one of our usual traders. Well, if someone wants in, they can earn it like everyone else. Let me speak to them. Sorry about that. Officer Edwards here was just doing his job. I'm sure you can understand our need for caution. For newcomers, we like to operate on exchange. You help us, we help you. Hmm. Depends. I need more details. Fair enough. Fusion cores. Three, to be exact. You get the fusion cores, we grant the access. What do you need them for? I'm no engineer, but I've been told we need them to help supplement our power generators. So if the task seems trivial to you, I assure you, it's very important to us. Okay, dobra, podzielimy się w sumie tymi rdzeniami. Mamy chyba około 50, więc nie powinno być problemu. No, okej, okay. tak się powinno załatwić wszystkie sprawy. Hmm, 
Ciekawe, czy się zdziwią. Że wbija to jakiś gość. W pancerzu wspomaganym. A, dobra. Staniemy sobie może tutaj. Zaparkujemy sobie nasz pancerzyk. A, też możemy pogadać w sumie. Z nimi tak, żeby widzieli, że jestem zwyczajnym gościem. Ok, to zagadamy do pani nadzorczyni. Ok, czyli dlatego potrzebują tych rdzeni, które ludzie im przynoszą z zewnątrz. A... Why do you keep yourself so isolated? Why not? We have warm beds, clean clothes, a solid roof over our heads. Our food and water are radiation free. We don't deal with the elements or raiders. We're safe here. And for some, that safety and stability is what counts. Mam trochę racji. You should be wary. The Commonwealth is a dangerous place. Exactly why we rely on a select few traders for our needs. That's why I like to use a give and take system. If outsiders are willing to help us, we're willing to help them. Speaking of, if you're ready, I can take those fusion cores from you. Okay, dobra, nie no, damy im, bo... Czemu by nie? Of course. Here they are. Thank you. Dr. Penske will greatly appreciate these. Now? I have work to do. Ma'am, what about the dog? I'll allow it. Security is already extra mindful as it is. If he's lived this long in the Commonwealth, I'm sure he's chosen his friends wisely. If you need anything else, I'll be in my office. Okay, później nie puszczamy. Hope you're not making any trouble. No, so uważaj, będziesz mi tutaj podskakiwał do chłopa, to ci chłop odgryzie to i owo. I będziesz miał. Dobra, w takim razie rozejrzyjmy się tutaj. Raczej kraść nie zamierzam. Chyba, że naprawdę jakaś perełka nam się tu trafi. Mam również nadzieję, że nasz pancerz będzie tu bezpieczny. So, we got a new visitor today. Don't say anything, but man, I'd love to be out there. If you want to leave, why don't you just go? Wish it was that easy. It's scary leaving the vault. And the Commonwealth? It's all so unpredictable. You should check it out. It's got a lot to offer these days. Maybe someday. At the rate we're working these days, maybe sooner than later. Why the long hours? We're just making sure this roof over our heads doesn't cave in on us. They say it's all the moving parts that have us working round the clock these days. Structurally, I guess 81 is still pretty sound. Vault Tech sure knew what they were doing when they set these places up. Well, I don't want to keep you, and I gotta get back to work. Maybe I'll see you around. Jasne, Neil. Może potem pogadamy. Dr. Penske runs a hydroponics lab here. She may have some work for you, if you're interested. Excuse me. Another outsider? What they let you in for? What's with the attitude? I don't trust outsiders. We didn't need your help before, we don't need it now. The Overseer never should have opened up the vault to your kind. Well, aren't you a ray of sunshine? You think you're funny? That's exactly why outsiders don't belong here. Okej, okay, pani Miranda widać e, nie jest zbyt przyjaźnie nastawiona. Ochrona krypty, to nie jest ten gość, co miał jakieś wąty do chłapka. Ok, popiołek. O chłap, zagryź, zagryź kota! So you're the reason the patrols are double today. Hmm. 
Dobra, chyba do windy, tak? Mam się skierować. Nic ciekawego nie macie, więc się nie ma co bać. Okej, okay, czyli wygląda na to, że tylko nas... E, no cóż, będzie interesować ta winda. W takim razie wbijamy. Okej, okay, w takim razie jesteśmy w środku. Hey mister, are you really from the Commonwealth? Me? No, I'm from the moon. Still got cheese in my shoes. I guess that was a dumb question. But I bet it's your first time here. I can show you around the vault if you want. Just five caps. Sure, but I'm not paying you. Okay, okay. <laughs> Boy, you're a real cheapskate. We'll start over here. Okej, okay, dobra, to idziemy za tym małym gnojkiem, który chciał. Wysępić trochę hajsu. Zobaczymy, co nam opowie na temat krypty. But he's always leaving her to do all the work while he hangs out with Tina. Next time, the Wydak. I bet you killed a lot of strange things. Ooh, and raiders. I bet you fought raiders too. Overseer's office is up there. They're busy up there, and they do not like to be bothered. She makes rules, but she's nice. I like her. Does she take care of people that break the rules? Security mostly takes care of the people who break the rules, but she's in charge of all of the security officers. It doesn't happen very often. Next stop, the diner. Now we gotta go downstairs. That's where the diner is. Everybody eats there. Sometimes it gets real crowded. The summer sets are nice though. You'll like them. Dobra, w takim razie zobaczymy jadalnie. Hmm. No, zobaczymy gdzie ta wycieczka nas zaprowadzi, tak naprawdę. I see you're showing our guest from the Commonwealth around. Yes, ma'am. This is the Sunshine Diner. Grant says that they'll take all of our hard work and turn it into swill. Mr. and Mrs. Somerset run the diner. They're pretty nice. Mrs. Somerset's pies are the best. Okay, spoko. Na pewno spróbujemy. How's their food? Other than the pies. I like it. Mrs. Somerset always sneaks me seconds. I'll save you a slice of pie, Austin. Next stop, Horatio. I Horatio? They were nice. Do you like your hair? I like mine. I hate combing it, though. Gran makes me comb it. Aha, dobra. Czyli fryzjer, tak? U. Magazyn. Austin, that hair of yours is a mole rat's nest. <laughs> This is where Horatio fixes up people's hair. Aaron's mom comes here all the time. Grand hardly comes here at all. She makes me cut my hair, though. It's not fair. If I ever need a new hairstyle, I'll come here. I hate getting my hair cut. Next stop is Grin. Let's go see Grin. Dobra, idziemy do babci, ale poczekaj, ja sobie wezmę to coś. Mm, odblokowujesz nowe wyjątkowe tatuaż na twarz. She's not my real grandmother though. My parents died when I was real little. No proszę, jaka 
Niewielka uprawa. Hi Grand. Austin, what are you doing here? Are you bothering that stranger from the Commonwealth? I'm not bothering him. I'm helping him. Hmm. That's Grand. She takes care of me. You can call her Dr. Pensky. She acts so grumpy. That's not for real. Says you. She runs our hydroponics lab. It's where we get all our food. You don't get anything from the Commonwealth? Nope. Grand grows it all here. She's really smart. Hmm. Next stop, Miss Katie. Oh, pani Katie. Come on. Znaczy, panna yeah. Katie. We gotta go to the other side of the vault. I'll show you where I go to school. I bet you didn't have to go to school. No, faktycznie. Szkoła. It's boring most of the time. But Grand says I have to go anyway. Your Grand is a smart woman, Austin. Are there a lot of kids in the vault? Not that many. The overseer says that we're using population control. Whatever that is. Next stop is the medical clinic. Let's go downstairs. I'll show you the clinic. Talk for no, okay, dobra, to idziemy do kliniki. But I don't go there unless I have to. Or unless Grand makes me. No, zobaczymy, dokąd nas ta wycieczka z naszym rudym, małym przyjacielem zaprowadzi. This is our medical clinic. If you get hurt or sick, come down here. Dr. Forsyth says I can't bother him or Rachel while they're working. Did you ever get sick? Just colds and stuff. Hardly anyone here gets sick. Mr. Somerset broke his foot once though. They put a big cast on it and he had to walk with crutches. Now we go see Erin. She's gonna be surprised when she sees you. Come on! This way. Erin and I spend a lot of time together. She didn't believe me when I said I would bring you to her. Hmm, ciekawe kto to jest. Ale widać, że to życie płynie tak spokojnie. No w sumie co nieźle się tu urządzili tak naprawdę. Aha. You're Austin's best friend? We've been friends forever. There aren't a lot of other kids in the vault. Thanks for doing my tour. I was so cool to show you off to everyone. Excuse me, mister. I have my cat. She's gone. Okay. What happened? He scratched me. And I yelled at him to go away. I didn't mean forever, though. His name is Ashes, and he's the best cat in the whole world. Okay, to widzieliśmy go tam na górze. I think he's left the vault. I saw him run by me when I got here. Left the vault? Oh, please bring him back, please. No one else would set foot outside for him. Where do you think he may have gone? Not far. He'd be terrified. I'm sure if there's anywhere nearby to hide, you'll find him. I'll find him for you. Thank you. His name is Ashes. He's the sweetest little gray cat. I just want him to come home. Okay, dobra. W takim razie poszukamy tego kota. W sumie nie mamy nic innego ważnego do roboty poza ratowaniem świata i takie tam najważniejszą decyzją, która jest przed nami. No, ale dobra. W takim razie będziemy szukać kota. Ale póki co rozejrzymy się tu jeszcze troszeczkę. Up 
jakaś ukryta kukurydza w kiblu. Ok, jeszcze z tym doktorem mieliśmy się spotkać. Z tym, że ten mały, rudy e, jegomość nie powiedział nam za bardzo, gdzie doktor może przebywać. No chyba, że jest w tej klinice. No ale to w takim razie zaraz będziemy musieli to sprawdzić. O, dobra, to raczej nie jest mi potrzebne. A, jakieś rękawice kuchenne też nie. Mm, Okej, okay, dobra. Myślę, że nie będziemy tracić czasu tutaj na przyszukiwanie tej krypty. Tak, pieczołowicie, a zajmiemy się tylko ewentualnie. Tak z grubsza, zobaczymy co i jak. Ok, znaleźliśmy doktora. I hope I'm not being presumptuous, but I'd like to ask you a favor. Would you mind donating some medical samples, even just a blood sample? Why do you need medical samples? It's for my research. The people of Vault 81 have been genetically isolated from the Commonwealth for many generations. I'm trying to determine what the genetic variation is between the two populations. Okay, dobra, myślę, że możemy mu dać trochę krwi. You can have some blood. Excellent. Just have a seat and I'll draw some blood. Sit there. This will only take a sec. There. Hardly hurt a bit, eh? Thank you. This will be a great help. Now, I need to get these prepared immediately. Okay, dobra, nie ma problemu. You're that wanderer from the Commonwealth. I'm Rachel. I assist Dr. Forsyth with his medical duties. Are you sick or injured? Do you get a lot of patients in the vault? No. The people of this vault are surprisingly healthy. If that's all, I have work to do. Od, e, pani Rachel nie dowiedzieliśmy się zbyt dużo. Hey, hold. So you're the new guy. I heard we let someone into the vault. How long do you plan on sticking around? Long enough to have a good look around. Well, hopefully that means not long. We can take care of ourselves here in 81. We don't need to be letting in every straight traveler that comes our way. Uh, ale był nie miły. Facilities in the Commonwealth and just how sanitary they must be. Będziemy tu zrobić masakrę jakąś. Dobra, to z nim mamy pogadane. Tego całego popiołka musimy poszukać. Oh, you're that new traveler. You must have had so many adventures out in the Commonwealth. Is it boring here in the vault? No, I love teaching these kids. But it's not the same as fighting to survive. Would you mind talking to my class about life in the Commonwealth? Uh... I'd be glad to talk to them. Marvelous. Stop by whenever class is in session. I'll just stop what I'm doing and turn the class over to you. Hey, Katie. 
Would you like to tell the students one of your stories now? No, that's it. What topics should I avoid? Nothing with excessive violence. And I'm sure they'll have lots of questions. I'd be glad to. Wonderful. The kids are so excited. Children! Children, listen up! We have a guest today who is going to tell us stories about the Commonwealth. Did you ever fight a Deathclaw? How do you know about Deathclaws? I hear stuff. Gran heard something about them from a Commonwealth guy. Deathclaws are very dangerous. It was a tough fight. How did you beat it? <laughs> Wouldn't you rather hear about when I fought mole rats? Not really. My dad says mole rats are just nuisances. Oh, świetna, świetna praca kamery. A group of raiders had my friend Preston trapped. But you rescued him, right? Preston showed me where to find some power armor I could fix. Power armor! Wow. Wow. Has the vault ever had problems with raiders? They don't bother us. They can't get in if we don't want them to. I wasn't ready when the death claw crawled out. Good thing I had that power armor. That sounds scary. I was hurt pretty badly, but Preston and I finally killed it. Wow, thank you so much for that story. Children, say thank you. Thank, thank you. you. And we have a thank you gift for you. Here. Oh, superowo. Dostaliśmy komiks za najgłupszą historię ever. Eee, na stałe otrzymujemy premium 5% dobrażeń krytycznych zadawanych w walce wręcz. Katie. Oh, you're that new traveler. You must have had so many adventures out in the Commonwealth. Okay, Katie już nie chce z nami rozmawiać, więc e, chyba więcej historii nam się nie uda. Mm, tutaj wcisnąć. Dobra, zajmijmy się tym całym popiołkiem, który gdzieś tam spierdzielił. Ale gdzieś tu do góry. Tak, trzeba w inną chyba wyskoczyć. Dobra, gdzie on może być? Gdzie do góry? Don't try anything. Terminal's gotta be somewhere. If only the Commonwealth wasn't so dangerous, I'd love to see more of it. Okay, może mi ktoś pomoże. Someday, I'll make it out there. Mhm. Próżno w to wierzyć. Aha, dobra, on gdzieś tutaj przy tym jeziorku się tam skitrał, więc musimy wyjść na zewnątrz. Dobra, w sumie pan coś wspomagany sobie stoi. Więc mam nadzieję, że kiedy powrócę do Krypto 81, to nadal tam będzie. Bo jeżeli nie, to inaczej będziemy musieli pogadać z mieszkańcami. I sell slashers and clobberers too for those maniacs that like it up close. But hot death flying faster than the speed of sound? Oh, my knees are getting weak just from thinking about it. I've got a few minutes to browse. Okay, zerknijmy co ma ciekawego. Did your heart skip a beat too?
Kasaciarz. E, no nie powiem, ma całkiem niezłe uzbrojenie. Mógłbym to coś kupić, ale... Nie wiem. Dobra, na razie sobie damy spokój, no ale ciekawa, ciekawa postać tak naprawdę. 